J.C. McIntyre, I'm about to tell a story about the Word of God, and this is a message about lemons, not lemons, I meant. Uh, it, it's a story about, about not pounding and complaining, and trusting in God. So, yeah, I want to tell you first before we start our story, this is going to, this verse is about the story. Proverbs 3, 5, and 6. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding. Okay. In, in all your ways. In all your ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. Proverbs 3, 5, and 6. So yeah, so there was a guy named Joseph. He he was very lonely and sad. Why? Because his brothers wouldn't treat him well, and he was very lonely. But and his father gave him a a jacket, and he liked it a lot. And why did he like the jacket? Because it had many colors. Oh. And it was a robe. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. And can you help me here, Mom? What happened to Joseph? His, his brothers didn't like him, so then what did they do? They put him in a pit. Oh, my. And they sold him. <gasps> As a what? Slave. Oh my gosh! And then what happened? He 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 was there for many days, and he had he had to follow Pharaoh's rules. And then now let me ask you something. That, it's all about pouting, right? Yes. The sermon is about not pouting. Yes. So did Joseph pout? No. No. What he did didn't he? Do a lemon. He didn't do a lemon. What did he do? He didn't pout. He didn't complain. He was just sitting there. And he was the king of jail. He was the king of jail. But what? Like the boss of The jail. boss of jail. But what happened before he became the boss of jail? How did he end up in jail anyway? The girl, the, his, the Pharaoh's wife. Potiphar. Potiphar. Potiphar lied to, um, to, to uh hit about him pharaoh what did she say about him he said she she said that um he, joseph tried to hurt her and then joseph was thrown into the jail and then in jail what happened he was the boss of jail because he didn't pout huh yeah. well he didn't pout what did he do he told people about God in there. Oh. And then what happened? They all they became Christians, right? Yeah. Well, they can acknowledge God. Yeah. Okay. We so, and then um JC, what does acknowledging God mean? I forgot that too. Well, remember if if you walk into the room, what and somebody acknowledges, what does that mean? They say, hi, JC. Oh, yeah. It's, it says, whoa, hey, JC. You're so, there, right? It, yeah. So what does acknowledging God mean? It means, hey, God, like that. Yeah. I, can't. I know you're here, right? Mm -hmm. And if we know God is there, then what do we do? How do we communicate with him? We pray. Yeah, or we can also Sing? Oh, yeah, that's one of them. Oh, we can trust him? Yeah, we can trust him. We can worship. Yes. We can preach. Yes. Share and with others. we can others. love. Yes. And not do the lemon, right? Yeah, no lemon. Exactly. So then what? tell us what happened with Joseph at the end. Well, he became... The second king. How did that happen? He 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 told uh, Pharaoh the dream, and he and he was like, "Someone tell me the dream," and 
And so Joseph did. He told him seven cow seven skinny cows ate seven big cows. Uh huh. And that message means that there will be many food in seven years and no no not many. There will be no food in the other seven years. Mm hmm. Okay. So, um, Joseph begins to help Pharaoh, right? Yes. To get ready for that. Yes. And then the only place that had food was Egypt, right? Yep. And he standed up to his brothers. So what happens? How did how did his brothers get to see him again? Well, he they wanted food. Oh. So they decided to do that. And so... They go to Egypt. They go to Egypt. And what happens? And they they're hungry and and they thought they would die because they were very mean to Joseph. But they said, but Joseph said, "Don't worry, brothers. I forgive you." Mm. Why Why do you think Joseph forgave his brothers after they were so mean to him? Because. You never make lemons. You never, you never say, "I'm angry at you. I won't forgive you." You don't do that. Why? What? Why do you not do that? Because it's the wrong thing to do, and you have to obey God, and and appreciate your brothers and sisters, and you have to love on each other. You don't like kill them. Yep. If you're in God, if you trust God's heart, you don't you don't do that. Absolutely. Is there anything else you would like to say about this story? What should we learn about Joseph's story? We never complain. We never say, "Hey, I'm angry at you. I will not forgive you. I'm not gonna make. We don't make lemons. We don't do anything like that." We trust. We, we trust in God and we love on our brothers and sisters. Anything else before I stop the recording? Um, no. You want to say bye? Bye. God Have bless you. you enjoyed this video and enjoyed this video and God bless you. Bye, JC. I love you. Love you too.